Let's this talk about is the crazy. Eighth that's happening and the connection it has with Easter. Watch this video get banned. <laughs> I have a book. It's from the 1800s. Let's do this. Here's the book in all its glory. Right here it says, The Passion of the Lord from Palm Sunday to Easter Eve, April 1st to April 7th, AD 30. Let's turn a couple pages. The Resurrection and Ascension of Christ from Easter Day to Ascension Day, April 8th to May 17th, AD 30. That's crazy. Totally not crazy. Truth. Now let me walk you through each day. Palm Sunday, April 1st. Monday, April 2nd, he cleansed the temple. Tuesday, April 3rd was Jesus' last teaching. Tuesday night, Jesus told his disciples the time of his betrayal. And then on Wednesday, April 4th, he remained in Bethany until Thursday. Thursday, April 5th, they killed the lamb for the Passover meal. Evening and night of Thursday, April 5th was the last supper. After supper, they went to the Mount of Olives and entered the Garden of Gethsemane. This is where he is taken and held captive. Good Friday, April 6th, he was arraigned and then taken to a place called Golgotha, the place of a skull, also known as Calvary. This is where he was put on the cross. Is it really a cross? But before he was placed on the cross, he was tortured and placed in a cell overnight. Saturday, April 7th, the Sabbath. Pilate condemned him, and from 6 to 9 a.m. were the preparations for the cross. At 9 a.m., he was placed on the cross, hung on the cross for the next three hours, dying. This is where it gets really... My heart's freaking racing. I never read this before. Listen. It was now noon, but such a noon as had never been seen in Judea. The position of the paschal full moon precluded the possibility of a solar eclipse, and yet a supernatural darkness rested upon all the land, from the sixth hour to the ninth hour, as if to veil the last agonies of the Redeemer from the eyes of men. But far deeper than that, darkness was the gloom that weighed upon the Savior's soul, as he bore the whole burden of the divine wrath for the sins of all men. He was on the cross all day until sunset, which was the beginning of the Sabbath. Saturday evening. Died in six hours, literally of a broken heart. Taken down from the cross and placed in a tomb. Sunday, April 8th, the resurrection of Jesus Christ. The solar eclipse is nothing other than proof to us that it happened. Jesus died on the cross to save us from our sins. In the solar eclipse, that was the veil. That is the proof. That is the reminder to us. Just as the rainbow is a reminder to us that God will never flood the earth again, the solar eclipse is Monday, April 8th, then Easter Sunday is Tuesday, April 9th. What are your thoughts? Tell me in the comments.